when working in Excel, merging cells can become quite disruptive if you're going to be doing a lot of copying and pasting of your data or if you're going to run various formulas off of your table. So today I'm going to give you an option to give you the look of a merge and center without actually removing the partition between cells. So really quickly, let's just show you a merge and center. You have a light blue background with this font total viewership in cell D5. If we highlight these two cells and click merge and center, it effectively makes this one cell with no dividing line and it gives a light blue color across both cells. If we unmerge, we'll see that it goes back to two separate cells, but we have to remove this color to return it back to normal. And I'm doing this simply to show you what the difference is between the merge and center and this new option. So we're going to highlight the cell we want centered and any contiguous cells that we would, we would highlight if we were doing merge and center. Right click and go down to format cells. In this tab you'll find a tab called alignment. You may have a newer version of Excel so it might look slightly different but you should still see an alignment tab. And you're going to go to horizontal alignment and select center across selection. And what that will do is it will move the font like a merge and center but the cells are two distinct cells and you can see that by the color differential between the two. So if we wanted it to have an exact same look as the merge and center we would simply select the same color across but we still have two distinct cells E5 and D5. D5 being the only cell that actually has data in it. So this can help clean up your data set if you're doing a lot of copying and pasting or running a lot of formulas against this particular table. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope this helps.